I fell into a really, really deep depression. Um, it was um, anxiety, depression, everything, man. Like, I would have um, call, like, I would call to the psychiatrist because they, they had, like, um, they had me calling and talking to them. And, like, low-key, dude, like, they would be like, are you, um, are you suicidal? And then, like, you, I would say no, but deep down in my head, dude, like, it's like, like, yeah, you know? And then um, they were giving me so many pills that, like, I didn't know what I was taking anymore. Like, I would be like, hey, dude, the pills aren't working anymore. And these guys would be like, oh, just umped up the, umped up the volume, you know? So it was like, I was getting lost. And then um, my mom would be like, because I would have, um, I would have um, mood swings. So and my mom would be like, dude, like you're just staring at the TV and you're not doing anything, you know? And then um, I remember uh, I got to a point where I was like, dude, I don't want to take this. I, like, I don't want to take this anymore either. Like you finish it off or what, you know? So I remember getting all the pills and I just flushed them down the toilet. Like I was like, I don't want to take them anymore, you know? And I kind of went through, because um, I got addicted, you know? I went through, um, I didn't go to, uh, what like um like I didn't go to uh how do you call it rehab rehab I didn't go to rehab I did everything by myself my mom was the one helping me so I remember going to the store and then, like we're here at the store the store's like wide open and just, I'm just feeling everything closing on me you know and I'm like I can't take it I gotta go out I was constantly in the ER I would go to the ER they would be like they would be like dude um are you taking your pills yeah I didn't have them anymore but I'll be like yeah and then they'll be like all right like, worst thing ever was spending um, Thanksgiving, like, spending all that, like, w weekend in the ER because I was, like, out of it. And then little by little, like, I remember posting something on uh, on Instagram. And then one of my friends, you know, like, um, Robert, Robert Brown, like, I knew him since back in the day. But we had, like, not grown apart because we would still be, like, yo, happy birthday and this and that. But we wouldn't kick it. And then I was, like... I feel I forgot what I posted, but like, like he hits me up, hey dude, come to my gym, and I was like, your gym? And he was like, yeah, dude, just come to my gym. Trust me, trust me. You listen that? And I was like, all right. Like I was like, I had gained so much weight that you know, like my um, cardio wasn't there. I remember going hiking with one of my friends that wanted to distract me. We went to uh, um, the old Melody, old Melody Park. Yeah. That first hill, dude. I just did that first hill, and I wanted to go back. I was like about to pass out, <laughs> and then no. Uh, my uh, cardio wasn't there. I was 232, almost 233 pounds. And, like, I'm like, well, what's your gym? You know, what do they do? And he's like, well, it's Muay Thai. And I'm like, what the hell is Muay Thai? You know, he's like, dude, trust me. You like it. You like it. And I was like, at the beginning, I'm like, all right, I'm going to go try it. So I got to that point where I was, like, I was lost. You know, like, I was, like, going into, a like, a deep black hole. And I was like, you know what? I was like, screw it. I'm going to give it a try. So I came here. I remember walking in and, like, I didn't even ask for the trial class. Like I just walked in and I was like, how much is it for like, if I want to come off five days? I think Jen was the one that helped me out. And uh, she told me the price and I was like, all right, here, here's my credit card, charge me. And then uh, she was like, are you sure? I was like, yeah, just charge me. And at the same time, that was for me because I was like, if I pay, if I pay for it monthly or like class or whatever, I know I might have a way out. Cause I'm gonna be like, dude, like save within that first month, I'm gonna be like, Ah, you know what, screw this, I'm not going to go again or whatever. And then for me, it was like, all right, I'm putting the money down for the whole year. That's going to keep me liable that if I'm not going, I'm losing my own money, you know? Mm. And then I was like, the more I can go, the better I'm taking advantage of, of the situation. So that's how I started coming here. Like, I would come here Monday through Friday. I would actually come to the 5 a.m. classes because um, my my homie Robert was like, dude, come to the seven the 7.15. So I, I'm always there. But at the same time, like, he he would, he would knew the way he knew me, I was completely, I wasn't that person anymore. So I guess I didn't want him to see me that way. So I was like, all right, let me let me try to get myself into shape. And then I'll start showing up with you and it's like, try to train with you, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's amazing, <laughs> That's man. Crazy. And I, 